Good morning. It is Sunday, September 9th, day 159. Do I look pretty shot? <laughs> Should. <clears throat> I'm able to move a little bit better today. I don't know how long it's going to last. I've started my death march today about uh, 6.45. My pack doesn't seem heavy. It's just that uh, I think I think I have an infection because uh, well, next to my backbone area down by the belt and to my right uh, cheeky, the top part of it, that part's swollen and very hot. So I think I have, uh, would that be a staph infection? Who knows? But uh, it's sapping the life out of me and giving me discomfort. So. But I have 11.4 miles to go today to reach some relief. So hopefully I can do that. Lately I, I walk and then they just keep slowing down, slowing down, decide, uh, well, it's time to uh, set up the tent. So, cause I'm not moving very fast anymore. So that's what I do. So hopefully uh, I'll be able to get to uh, a ball bridge and uh, things will improve from there. Box turtle out. Pretty easy walking up here. Wish it was all like this. Kind of like sidewalks. Nice breezy day today, sunny. Stopped here at the herd shelter for a break. I'm gonna sign in at the, the register there. There's uh, some people here building a new privy, said it'll be done tonight, but I'm not gonna stick around for that. This must have been the old one here. There's where we're at. I gotta go a good three miles to get out of here. Just gotta tough it out. Getting a lot of encouragement from uh, Real Nice. She's been uh, pulling me along, so appreciate that. All right. Let's get it done. Well, this has been quite the day. I finally limped out of the 100-mile wilderness. Uh, ended up going to the emergency room. And uh, after CAT scans and blood work and all these other kinds of things, they're gonna ship me to Portland to do some surgery. I have that uh, spot on my back and my right buttocks. It's, it's, it's infected and uh, I don't know how long it's gonna take or I don't know if I'll be able to get back on the trail, how soon. And, but this would be the end of day 159, Sunday. September 9th, by the way, uh, there was a guy that gave us a ride from the trail all the way up to Millinocket. He really saved us. His name was uh, Robert. So what a trail angel that was. But here's the bigger story. I, I talked about a uh, young lady I met uh, a few days ago. Her trail name is real nice well she saw me today after I started walking and uh, I guess she had pity on me she stayed with me the whole day uh, and towards the end she ran ahead and uh, when I came out on the road she had ice cream and snacks waiting for me uh, she rode with me to the hospital and she stayed there till like 10 o'clock at night until it was, uh, I finally realized that I wasn't going to go to the hotel anymore, the motel, that I was going to sh get shipped out. And, uh, but uh, she was my guardian angel. Can't say enough about her. Uh, it, was, it was great to have the support. Wasn't feeling too well. 
for obvious reasons. I didn't know how bad it was. But uh, I don't know when this is going to continue or who knows. I'm like 14 miles short of summiting Mount Katahdin. I have pictures of it. Hopefully we can uh, come back and finish this off. All right. Thanks for your support.